Welcome back everybody to Farming Simulator 19 here on Madison Creek 19. Y'all, old whoop, <laughs> not the most. Mr. Blue, aka Tommy Miller. Folks, how are y'all doing today? What, me? I'm doing just wonderful. I'm getting to talk to y'all. It's always wonderful to get to make a video for y'all and share some of the things that's going on. <sighs> I had some teeth pulled. Um, kind of giving me still some trouble. Two of them healed up. The gums healed up pretty good. But the, the third one next to my cutter teeth in front, I guess the uh, filling or whatever came out. Not the filling, but the, the stuff they put in there after they pull a tooth and then sew it up. Well, it, I guess it came out and it left a little hole there. But it's healing up, getting to be better. You know, I, I can eat now. So that's all, always wonderful. Uh, yeah, folks, we are doing some herbicide spraying. Um, this is our southeast grassland field. And let's go in here and show y'all real quick before I get to the end up here. Yeah, that's what it's looking like right here. Um... We got all this down here sprayed so far. Um, I don't think, I think I might turn around here and just go back and forth here. Getting this, then go get this. I, I don't know it for yet. But I do know, I think when I get down to the end, I'm going to circle around this way and go that way and get some of that and come back. But first, let's, let's jump in here. Um... Field 3 and 1, 1918, we're waiting on. It still ain't turned. This is the second day of summer. I guess it needs another day. But we got wheat, and then we got canola, and we need to plant. And I'll show you all that here in a second. But first, we got some uh, contracts we need to finalize here. Um, as you can see, we, we have a lot of them. I'm not going to go through calling all the prices out. Y'all just going to have to look and see right here. Um, I'm going to go ahead and start collecting. And that's my phone. So I'm going to be in a pause. Be right back. All right. We are back after that rudely phone call. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm just going to go in here and complete these. And y'all can look at them as I go. Right. Yeah. Mom pulled back up. She forgot a couple of things before she went to the doctor. So, yeah. Well, we got that squared away. And it looks like I'm about to have to close this out to make my turn. I'm glad they have the uh, see-through like that. And get them completed in time. I was going to look and see how much money I had at the time. I don't look like nothing we need right now, so let's go to here and then uh, back out of that. Oh, look at this perfect timing. We're back up to 3,172,000, folks. You're know, probably like, I should believe, wouldn't you? Are we at 3 million in the last episode? Eh. No, I wasn't, was it? Y'all didn't see that. Uh. I'm going to put some inserts right here of me selling some wood chips and selling some equipment. So uh, y'all enjoy that real quick while I'm spraying around this building.
I just want to show you. I don't know if y'all seen the uh, antenna tire up here or not. And then our small solar field we well, I wouldn't really call it solar field. But yeah, uh, let's see. Let's turn our spray boom off. I think we got any weeds right here anyway. They're all right up there. You can see the little patches there. Right over here real quick. I've probably done this in another episode, but this thing here is a weather station. It, it makes us a little bit of money, but the solar panels does a little bit more. And as you can see, what I just showed y'all was some of the midnight prices. Oh, we got some weeds over here on this side. Eh, well, those will be alright. But yeah, uh, this is our shop, and uh, we got an antenna here where we can talk on the two ways. A uh, bunch of batteries and that little thing to to uh, make up for this thing. And I think they got some batteries back here on this back part too. Um, this little building here, there's a bunch of transformers and just all kind of goodies that goes from uh, the solar panels to it and then they ran a trench over to there and then that antenna's tied into it and stuff so gonna be a couple more of them going up around the uh the north area there so yeah um i'm going to try and get this field finished and we are also i'm gonna, almost well i already showed y'all that didn't i that the fields ain't ready yet so hopefully the time i get this field done um we uh can uh start harvesting so i'll figure it'll probably be around 11 o'clock anyway so but anyway i will be right back folks load them up and move them out we're going to plant cotton folks while we're heading there let's go in here and show you right here cotton 61 degrees we are in the white we're clear to plant so is soybeans uh, but anyway we're focused on cotton we are about halfway in so that means we're going to be about here when we're going to harvest somewhere in here hopefully we can get it out before the snow but anyway speaking of the weather we got some rain here at 1800 let's see it's three four five six it'll be six o'clock i don't know why i do that anybody that's in the military do their time just take two away yeah that's all you gotta do like 1500 take two away it's three o'clock 1800 take two away six o'clock p.m. so yeah anyway uh, we do have some weeds in this field but you know what it's gonna be all right uh, we are going up in the top corner here I wanted to uh, get this field here harvested but I think we need to go ahead and plant and let's go on this map here you can see they're still not ready what i was going to do is have it cut off even here but that's all right we're going to have uh all four and five in cotton here and uh three and, and one and 19 and 18 is going to be probably soybeans if we get a chance to But yeah, we're uh, not going to worry about turn roads on this end. But when we get to the other end, we'll do across the end there. Uh, mainly, we're going to have workers doing this. This is going to take a while, folks. Yeah, it's going to take a while. And I needed to go pick up some weights for these tractors. But I think I'm going to have them delivered and uh, put on. So uh, let me go do that real quick and I'll be right back. When I said I was going to have them delivered, I wasn't kidding. I took the tractor that had the uh, stump grinder and stuff on it. 
Now we're gonna drop these weights off. And you're probably like, Mr. Bleak, what kind of weights are those? Oop, wrong one. Drop the front one there. And these are the lizard lightweight. And I don't mean light, I mean as in brightness light. And we're gonna put them on the front of these. We do have a liquid fertilizer in the saddle tanks or whatever, side tanks, saddle, side, whatever you wanna call them. Uh, to me it's side tanks, but some people do call them saddle tanks. Now let me get these hooked up and I'll be right back in another second. Okay, that looked like it would blind me, but there's the lights. You can uh, also hit uh, left bumper and A. Well, when you have it on, the weight. There you go. You can rotate that light to the back, or you can rotate it to the front. Let's see here. There goes all of them on together. And that bright beacon off. There goes our lights and our front weight 35 kg, 3500 kg, I should say. But anyway, yeah, that's enough about that. Um, unfold this thing so we can get started. So we do have cotton, and uh, like I said, fertilizers and side tanks. I don't think this will put any down. Well, yeah, we, we, we're fixing to go to town here, folks. We are fixing to go to town. So get that on, get that on. We're going to do the east to west. So I'm going to hit this a couple of times and land on east to west. Do that. Hit the auto whip. And, um, and of course, we don't have a line. Of course, we don't have a line. What was I thinking? Yeah, I know, grade line. That's what I'm gonna do here. I'm gonna get lined up best to my knowledge. Let's see here, hit this again. Snap train angle is on. Sure, all the way no side. Okay. Um, all right. Get our little A here started. Where's our little A? I don't see our little A. There's our little A, as you can see, it's going past the planter now. And then, boom, 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 boom. You know what? I am going to leave it about right there. Just, I, 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 these are going to be brand new cotton pickers we're getting, folks. They're like almost a million dollars a piece. I do not want them scratched up so we're going to stay away from the trees as much as possible and we're going to come back as far as we can to plant because like I said that that's going to be uh, we might come back in here and plant a little bit more cotton I don't know but uh yeah get this bad boy fired up yeah down we go, and in the ground it goes. There goes the planter down. Uh oh, but that one's gonna fly off the hinges there for a second. Okay, well it's not making no extra textures, but we are planting. I got the course play going there. Screenshot. But of course, right? We're going to do this first through here. I'm trying to get a good screenshot. I'll tell you what, we're going to go back in here for a second, folks, and show lines. We're going to turn that off. There we go. We're going to take a picture right there. Oh, yeah, that's that's beautiful. 
All right, what, what this is is a strip till. That's like a big shank going into the ground. We got cutters on the front here. And then it's piling up the dirt. Whoop, get my camera right. Right here, uh, that's a big old shank. And then we got some uh, blades here that's throwing the dirt that's supposed to be up on a row. Then we got the packers packing it down. And then we got the planter planting on top of that. And we got gauge wheels back here to support that. And like I said, we are going to leave a good uh, thing right there between the trees so we don't have to worry about it. Now, the reason why I'm going to do the, the first through, simply for the fact there's trees on the left there. And y'all know what trees do, right? They mess up with our workers. They get going so far and they're like, oh, tree, I gotta turn around. I can't go no further past it. And they'll be miles away on the left. But you get that first through, they shouldn't do that no more. So, yeah. But anyway, I, I'm not wanting y'all to see this whole thing. Uh, so what I'm going to do is go ahead and bring you back when I get this round done. Uh, Planting an 8 mile an hour, which is not bad. Got a long ways to go. Let's go on our PDA here, or whatever you want to call it. We are still green on these. Um, so, yeah. But this field here, it's... It's coming along. I just I don't know if it's going to get green by end of summer or not. Maybe we get one good cut off of this. Uh, that'd, that'd be awesome. Let's go in here and see if we got. Oh, we do. We do. Oh, 85,000. We'll take that. We'll get a, a fertilized rig on that. Then 9,000, 4,000. And then what's this? Uh, soybeans. Um, I don't think we'll quite get into that right yet. Of course, that's going to be corn. But anyway, yeah, that's, that's, that's what it's looking like right there, folks. Uh, you can see our first strip here. If I knew he, we're going to go all the way down here. We're going to go four and five, folks, with cotton. That's right. I'm going to show you right here. It should be white for cotton. And we are white. <sighs> now, I do have an extra combine. Um, Y'all should see that. And this screenshot right here where I bought it. Hey, what do you think about that? And don't forget, folks, this, uh, I'm not ending the video right here, but I do want to take a minute to sponsor myself. Uh, I'm an Amazon affiliate. I hope I said that right. I have a can crusher, and I also have a, uh, I can't think of the name of it, it's V-I-L-T-R-O-X camera, right? You can click on either one of those links, and um, if you want to purchase those things if not still click on the link then go somewhere else and buy something else you want say like you're going to make an order anyway on Amazon just go to my link there if you don't mind and then browse around and buy what you want it helps me out still that way I won't get as much of a commission off of it but yeah as long as you use my link and then go buy something even if you don't buy the light or the can crusher, if you just buy something else, it'll help me out a lot. So, uh, yeah. Uh, fortunately, I don't know if it works out of state, out of the United States. Um, there are other links that I need to try to get for that. Um, so, uh, I don't know. Y'all can try it. I don't know. I think it's just for the United States right now. But, yeah, I've just been busy with other stuff. I ain't had time to do overseas and stuff, so. But anyway, I'll be back in a second, folks. All right, folks, finally made it here to the end. To the end, yeah. All 
Alright. My light shut off for. I hired a worker somehow. Huh, huh, huh. No, 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 no. Not yet. Let me get turned around, buddy. I get turned around here, then I'll hire you. Now, as far as. I, I guess I need to do cross the end. But I'm hoping the worker will know what to do. So, yeah. I might try to catch them. But I think I'm just going to. Eh, I guess I guess I can back up. I can back up. You know, one thing I haven't noticed though. Can I create fields with this? I don't see it where I can do it anywhere. Uh, nope. Nope. Oh, okay. Alright, lock GPS back on. We're going to turn this on and lower down. Well, we skipped a little spot there, but it'll be alright. I am working with my GPS lines off, folks, so. Yeah, now what I'm going to do is hire a worker. Just under your GPS and hit B button. No, I don't want AI. I do not want AI on this. Go to here. I'm going to turn that off. Yeah, I just want regular worker. And then hit B. And we are still planting cotton. Yes. Okay, good. Why you have to skip a spot? Yeah, we're going to see what happens there, folks. Yeah, finishing up a little patch right here. I decided I'd go ahead and do the end rows over so far. Kind of square this end up. So that he won't have a problem. Or she. Don't know who's in there. Says Betty, but... I don't have a... Well, I guess I do have a Betty. Um... She used to work at Walmart a long time ago. Uh, I think she's retired now. Uh, wonderful lady. Can't remember her last name though. That's what happens when you get old folks. Alright, well we're waiting on him. And I hate getting stuck between these tanks. I don't know how a fat person would get out in real life on these things. Hmm. Yeah, I never had saddle tanks or side tanks, side quests. Okay, we call them side tanks. Mine was always on the front, about three, four hundred gallons. Gauge wheels look okay. They're all hard, so they got air in them. Just to give you an idea of what this kind of looks like here. You can see how those blades just kind of push the dirt up in the hill there, and the packers pack it down. And, of course, you know what the planter does. It's going to work our way through here, make sure everything's tight. Everything looks pretty good. Our vacuum there. Right, yeah, everything looks pretty good across here. Come on, buddy. You going to turn around? Okay. I knew we were going to have problems. Oh, no. Let me, let me get out of the way here. Sorry, Betty. No, oh, wait, 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 wait. Betty, you're going too far. I've already done this. Okay, she was coming on. Stop. Now, that is one thing I don't like about it. You can see right there. We'll back up a little bit. We're going to turn this back on. Lay it down. Get that little section right there. Hit B. Come up with it. 
you have to be rolling when you lift up on this. All right. So that is our first round in the field 45, I guess we can call it, because it's or 54, 45, 54, whatever. Field four and five put together. Now, if our GPS is still correct here, which I doubt it, probably had to shoot over a little bit. Yeah, I'm gonna. I don't know, it kind of looks like all the money to me. Let's turn this back on. We'll get back right here and we're going to let down. There we go. Yeah, it looks like it's going to be on the money to me. I, I'm kind of glad I put fertilizer in here because it's fertilizing. It's probably fertilizing all of it. But the areas where I didn't fertilize, it's definitely turned it blue. Alright, take the GPS off. Power worker. Alright, I, I wish I had both of these back to back. Come on, go, jump out. Jump out. Wanna jump in? Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. Friends now, huh? Friends, you just go ahead with your bad self. Folks, 3,173,000, and we got some pretty good equipment here. If I can just get inside it. Oh, it's too far away. <laughs> okay, we're going to follow right in behind them, behind friends here. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to back and forth like that until we get across. Um, like here I got the ends about halfway down there and I have a film probably uh, it's going to probably end up going into canola anyway I just have that filling now I'm going to turn our planters back on get it charged we're going to drop down about right here before I even start um, oh I want that off. It should be off. I'll pull up a little bit further. Only reason I want to hire workers to do this. One, we got the money. Oh, take that off. And no, I don't want AI. I thought it was off. Now I can click it off. And hire a worker. As long as I stay with my GPS. Please don't leave a gap. You're gonna leave a gap. You're gonna leave a gap. Don't leave a gap. Oh, well, they'll be spaced apart, won't they? Alright. Here we go. Alright, GPS off. And tire worker, and there we go. Now I can go do other stuff. Get out of his way. This only thing I hate. Yeah, there we go. We are in our John Deere S690 2015 model, folks. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And kind of laggy down here with the equipment and stuff. And then this is what our... I don't know. We're lagging. This is what the X9 looks like. That's the 1000. The 1100 X9 is supposed to be coming out pretty soon. Let's check our... Uh, oh, no. I'll do that. No, that's fruit types. Gross. Okay, we... Our field still hasn't done anything yet. And as you can see right there, that is our, what we got planted so far. Yeah, it's about halfway on that. When this guy gets down here, I'm going to go 
down and back so we have an in row or turnaround area and uh yeah i'll just be watching them while i'm doing other things in between like we can get some uh Field 30, 32, 34, and 37. Why can't it be 36? I'm going to do 37 first. Now field 37 is um, 34, 32, 37. I'm going to have to get a fertilized tanker over on that side. But anyway, folks, I'm going to end it right here. It's about 30 minutes in, give or take. Um, yeah. But don't forget, don't forget about the links down below, folks, and especially about the Amazon link. If you got to purchase something from Amazon, just go ahead and go through my can crusher or my camera light and then search. Go at the top, search what you want to. Uh, it'll give me credit that way. You don't have to, but I would really appreciate it. Um, I would like to see this work. Uh, if it does, I'm going to try to push it harder as far as making videos about the light and the can crusher. So if I can see, I got 22 clicks on there. Actually 26. 22 clicks in the last month and like 4 or 6 clicks in this one or something like that. But yeah, maybe in tomorrow's or the next episode... We can get these two bad boys running. I can't wait to see the combines in action. But folks, thank you so much for watching. I love each and every one of y'all. Y'all have a great day, a blessed day, and I'm going to get out of here. Later. Well, it's a game. I'm not gonna play, but maybe you should do it.